welcome back to another grocery haul and meal plan. We have a weird week coming up. Um, we were going to go on a little trip um, towards the end of the weekend. So I went to the grocery planning on only a few meals. Now, y'all know I have a ton of stuff here. So now we got back home and things have changed. And so we've switched it to next weekend that he's, we're not going to go on a trip, but he's going to take off because we've got stuff going on. Um, so now I'm going to have to come up with the two um, or the other meals. But like I just said, y'all know I have a ton of stuff here. So I'm going to show you my grocery haul, um, the stuff that I have or that I bought. And then I'm going to go through and make my full um, meal plan and then um, tell y'all kind of like okay I have this here you know so or y'all will see like what we had to buy versus what we have because I mean we've got stuff for full meals we should be good um, and then you know all we needed was you know milk and eggs and we needed some stuff that was not groceries but you all will see that as well um, sorry we were in the pool today so my hair is like curly and my makeup's running but so that is kind of the plan so i will show you um i gotta look over and redo my meal plan and then i will show you guys that but let me get you turned around and i will show you what we got okie dokie so we did go just to walmart um this time and i took luke with me um you all know how we normally have a budget. Is it just, is it just me? But if I go by myself, I do better. And then if he goes with me, we get stuff that wasn't on the list. And so our budget's more. <laughs> Let me know in the comments down below if that's just me or is it other families as well. If you take your husbands to the grocery, you know you will always be off budget. But uh, we spent a total of $101. And this is everything that we got. So I'm going to start back here. We got this Tony's Pizza. And he actually has it in the oven right now. We got one of these big packs of the 15 patties. These are the ones that we got for Winston's birthday. And we really enjoyed them. Um, so we would refer these um, for you all to try them out as well. So we picked up a pack so we could do a couple meals if we wanted to grill um, some hamburgers. And then non-grocery items. I picked up this Johnson's Baby Oil, Baby Creamy Oil. Um, I have read a ton on, like I've seen it going on Facebook and Pinterest, that this is really good for um, babies and kids to help keep mosquitoes away. And Winston has been ate up. So I'm going to give this a try. Hopefully that will help. And if it does, I'll let y'all know. Um, I picked me up some razors. Yes, these are men razors. But the men razors are so much better. If y'all have not tried any, um, definitely go give them a try. Because it's a closer shave where they're made, um, you know, for their face. So these are perfect. Um, go try these out. I was the same way. I just used girl razors, little razors, and then my grandma got us some. And you know, Luke doesn't shave because he has a beard, so I used them and I loved them. So I had to go pick me up some more. Luke needed a toothbrush, so we picked up this. He also needed some deodorant, so he picked up that kind. And then back to the groceries. Um, Luke's gonna take a spinach salad one day this week for. Um, his work and we got, he got some cheese and garlic crout croutons <laughs> croutons um we got a bag of spinach um i picked up my favorite velveeta sauce um cheesy sauce package you know i love these and i always try to keep them in the pantry there is three in here um and you can do like um a cup and a half of cooked pasta and add one of these and you've got mac and cheese right there and you don't have to spend seven bucks on the big old block so those are really good we needed some condiment items we got some or luke got some blue cheese dressing 
Then I got my favorite honey mustard dressing. Picked up some soy sauce. We were out of ranch. Y'all know I love my ranch, so I just picked that up. And then we also finally ran out of this mild um, Taco Bell sauce, so I picked up one of those. Luke picked him out a bang drink. He's really been enjoying these, and this is the Purple Haze. Is this the one you've already tried? Yeah, it tastes like uh, grape sweet tarts. It, he said it tastes like grape sweet tarts, so he really likes this one. And then we got um, two steaks. It's, it's supposed to rain quite a bit this week, but if we're able to catch um, an evening that it's not raining, we're gonna cook, we're gonna have steaks. And then he picked out, um, he got a, this jar of salsa. This stuff is so good. Y'all gotta give it a try. Good on eggs. He said it's good on eggs. It's good anyway, but, <laughs> but we got this before and we're just trying it. No, did it, nobody recommended it, did they? No, I just seen it and I like the ingredients. Um, but I, we would recommend it now because it's very good. Y'all go give it a try as well. Okay, they do have, so they got hot, extra hot, medium, and mild. So y'all can go try. Um, but here's what the label looks like. We got some cheese cubes. You know, that's like a weekly staple. Um, I got a couple packages of taco seasoning. I like to keep some in the pantry um, in case. And then I got a packet of dry ranch. I needed a packet of dry Italian and I could not find one. So I might run up to Aldi um, just to get one of them. I found these in the freezer section. I have never seen these before, but I'm going to give them a try. Um, looks like I'm not eating it, but I thought this would be cool. I could make it like for lunch or this is half a bag. So do half for lunch and like one day and do half for lunch at every other day. But it's pesto spirals and it says that it's carrots and zucchini with extra virgin olive oil and white pepper. So they got pesto, pepper, I mean, and the first ingredients are zucchini and carrots. It says water, it's got Parmesan cheese, basil, butter, lemon juice, garlic powder, salt, white pepper. So that sounds good. It says pour frozen contents in the bag in a skillet. Cover and cook over medium heat approximately five minutes. Remove lid and continue to cook for three to four minutes until the product is cooked through. So we'll give it a try and see how it is. Um, I like carrot, cooked carrots and zucchini, so I was excited to see that. Um, Luke was able to try um, the brown sugar um the brown sugar pop tarts of the bites so we've seen these and we thought you know what we're just going to give them a try um, and see how the strawberry are we got us um an eight pack of corn frozen corn i got some vinegar i needed more for laundry i got a half a gallon of milk of course y'all know we have to have um a six pack of l8 every week and then we picked up some of the Chipotle chicken breasts. I absolutely love this stuff. If y'all have not tried the Chipotle, make sure y'all go give it a try. And then Luke picked out Winston two Lunchables. Um, he got the, the bologna one and he got him the um, chips and salsa and cheese. And then um, I needed... Um, I needed some rotisserie seasoned chicken. This is already cooked and cut, so it's perfect for easy um, lunch ideas for Luke. So I'm actually going to um, use one of Kristen Stepp's husband's um, husband lunch recipes that she did on that video. Um, if I, I'll find it and link it in the description box so y'all can go check it out. But she did amazing lunches for her husband, and I'm going to um, do the the wrap with the chicken um so that will be good oh and he also luke also picked out these caramel coconut fudge cookies these are better than the girl scouts so just so y'all know these are better and these are what 98 cents the cookies? yeah 
Okay, these are $1.36, but the the mint and the peanut butter ones are 98 cents. So they're definitely cheaper and they're better. They're better. Um, the only other thing that's not on the table that's in the car is a 12 pack of green tea. Luke's gonna be taking that to work with him. Um, and I forgot I bought burritos, but I may have left them in the car because I do not see them. So I just got a packet of burritos. But this is everything that we got. So let me redo my menu. Um, based off what I have in the house and then I will get back on here and I'll show you the meal plan here is the menu that I worked out um, it is Monday and we actually are having beef stroganoff I know that this has been on the menu like for three weeks now and I'm actually cooking it right now <laughs> we're gonna do Plano tacos and um, with some rice I'm gonna do Italian chicken pasta we're gonna do burgers, and I don't know what side I want. Um, I went to um, a fresh market, and I got some potato, like little potatoes and some green beans. So I'll probably do some potatoes and green beans with the burgers. Um, like I said in the last video, we always, um, for the time of summer, we are always gonna keep one day as grill out, because that's normally what happens which y'all seen in the grocery haul that we picked up some steaks um and then we're gonna do a crock pot chicken with some veggies i'm gonna do like potatoes and carrots um in there with that probably some more green beans um but i've got like chicken thighs i have chicken tenders i have all kinds of stuff um chicken drums that i can put and use that and then we're also going to have breakfast. Um, I got some hash brown patties. We got some bacon in the freezer. We always have eggs. So that is a quick and easy dinner that I can throw together. But this is the meal plan. I'm going to show you what I got from the farmer's market. And then this will be the end of this video. And here is everything from the farmer's market. And I picked up one zucchini and two squash um, my grandma and i split a watermelon um these are sugar babies they're very good watermelons um, and it was huge so i don't need that much y'all know it's just me and winston that eat it so we split it and she paid for that i got some little potatoes and then i got a couple of green beans i'm just gonna um you know break off the ends and cook them real good and then i'll cook them with some some of these potatoes so that will probably be with the burgers because that sounds really good but all of this right here was six something. So I got fresh veggies for like six bucks. Um, and like I said, my grandma paid for that. So I'm going to get supper going because I'm starving and it's already eight o'clock. 